Hey guys, it's Brittany. Today I'm going to be doing a what is on my Samsung Galaxy S24. I've been very excited to do this video and I'm ready to show you guys how I customized it. So to begin, these are my phone cases. I was just going to show you guys a couple cases I do own. So currently I have this one on my phone. It's just a simple silicone case with this charm I got from AliExpress. And um, this case I thought was too plain, so I had to add a little something, and now it's just very cute, so I absolutely love it. And this one I actually showed in my unboxing video um, that I did previously, so I got it on Amazon, and this case, or sorry, this pop socket is from AliExpress as well, and I thought I needed to add a little something to make it cuter, because... I'm never content with something super simple. I always want a little something extra on the side. So I thought that was cute. And then this case I got on Amazon is just a pink glittery case that looks really nice on the phone and I loved it. So these are the only cases I have right now. Usually I have a bunch. I own like 10, but I just, yeah, these are great right now. So I won't be spending too much money. I've learned my lesson. <laughs> so when you first open up my phone, this is how my home screen Page looks like um, I absolutely am in love with it um, and I spent like an hour trying to search for the perfect wallpaper the perfect theme and of course we have pink because I am in love with it um, so to begin I do have this widget up here from Widgetopia it just tells me the time and the date and then here I got a little picture or I got a picture of headphones and then I have the Google bar I always need Google just because I'm always searching things up and I just need it handy and then here we have a Google folder and I got all the Google things that I usually use. Um, then I have other, so I have clock, contacts, gallery, wallet, calculator, and daily life. Daily life is just like another app for you to write notes in. And then here I got Spotify favorites and this is from Widgetopia as well. So as soon as you open it up, it takes you to your Spotify as you can see. So. Go ahead and follow my Spotify, guys. Oops. So my Spotify is actually Brit.Liz25, and it doesn't even show that. So anyway, um, then at the bottom, I have a socials folder. I have Snapchat, Discord, Twitter, Pinterest, Poshmark, TikTok, YouTube, and Threads. Um, I always typically call it Twitter. I can't deal with the fact that now it's just an X. Um, and for my Pinterest, I have a lot of inspiration for homepage layouts. I also have a lot for um, icons because I know people were um, wanting to see wallpapers and I believe this is the one I have on my phone right now. So I have everything there. I have a phone icons PNG folders because I know a lot of you want to know um, some of the icons I have on my phone. And then at the bottom I have daily, so I got Canvas Student, Gmail, and YouTube. I always use these most of the time at least. Um, and then settings and then another picture is just a little camera which is on my Pinterest on my board if you guys are interested. And then down here I got messages, phone, and camera. I always use those. They're very handy there. Um, and then my next homepage, I got the calendar. And then at the bottom I have batteries. So I got just my, um, my phone and then whenever I connect my AirPods, it just pops up. And next, last but not least, I do have these widgets and these did not fit on my homepage anymore. So I kept them here because they were just so cute. I didn't want to, um not have them so I have like a little thing that reminds me to do things like tidy up read God's word and stay hydrated so drink water and then I got my battery and the time and the date and then another cute calendar that has my um name on it so that is what's on my Samsung S24 I hope you guys enjoyed the video I have been very excited to film it and I absolutely love doing it for you guys so thank you for watching all the time and I love you stay tuned for more bye